Man, big shout out to Walmart Warrior Fishing. Always reminding the rest of you guys to smash that like, homies. Our man Nicholas Gersoy, um, one of our members, he's interested in getting Hummingbird Live. What is the smallest or cheapest head unit? Helix, Solix, etc. Could I run with it? Um, man, you're a Lawrence guy, right, Joey? And I'm a Garmin guy right now. Yep. I haven't yep. been a bird guy for a few years. And honestly, I, I don't know which would be the smallest and cheapest you can get away with. I know on the Garmin side, you can get away with like a seven inch Echo Map with the live scope transducer. That makes it pretty affordable. And it's a seven inch screen, but it's doable. I have a nine inch screen on my little 13 foot tin boat that works great. I mean, I don't have a problem looking at that screen versus my 12s on the dream machine. Um, so I would feel comfortable with a nine, maybe a seven inch screen. How do you feel about that, Joey? Well, you know, and, and that's true because, you know, I, I switched over to a carbon 12, um, HDS carbon 12. And to be honest, I had an FS nine before that. That was my first setup was an FS nine. And to be honest, the FS9 kind of had a little bit better clarity, you know, clarity than than the carbon. I was going to say the same thing. I, it's not it's it's not as big, but the clarity was a lot better. Now I have a bigger screen, but it's kind of yeah. it's just not the same same motive. So if you were to go about it, um, honestly, an FS7, you know, even an FS7, when you're getting that for six seven hundred bucks. And then you buy your module, right. which you can probably get for a thousand bucks. I mean, you're in it, fifteen hundred bucks, and you could really make it happen if you wanted to do it. Um, you don't need you don't need a giant screen to use this technology. Um, I, I, you know, if all it came with was a four inch screen, a three inch screen, I'd be able to make it work. You know what I mean? Damn, a three inch screen, son! You got some good vision. Well, <laughs> the thing is, let me tell you, there's one secret on the forward facing sonar. Use your oh. use your zoom buttons. Your zoom buttons. Okay. Mm. You can you can shoot out super far, but use your zoom buttons. You can get a little bit clearer image out farther if you know how to work the system. So just keep that zoom in Look minus five. Now, I'll give you guys some, some little tricks and techniques, but you know, farther, farther the distance, use your zoom button. You, you might be surprised at what you can find. You know, if you're fishing a certain body or a certain area of water, I mean, you can, <laughs> you can zoom in pretty far and see what you want to see from a very far ways away. Wow. So. That's a profound tip. Profound. Thanks for sharing that with our audience. And Nicholas, uh, something else for you to consider. Since you're a member, you get a discount code, and that discount code could be 5, 10, 15, or even... 20% depending on your membership level, but you can order a Garmin live scope transducer and a head unit with your discount code. Uh, that's something that's only available to our Big Bass Dreams YouTube members because normally you're not allowed to purchase any of that high end stuff, especially electronics, on any sort of a discount. So, any of you, any of you guys that have been on the fence about getting some elect, uh, expensive electronics, you'll pay for your membership multiple times over right then and there. And maybe that's that difference in price break that would uh, allow you to step up from a seven or uh, to the nine inch or the nine to the 12, uh, et cetera, et cetera. All right, so that was an excellent question from Nick. Um, 